Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to show you how to train an AI art model on the Leonardo AI Art Generator website. So on your favorite web browser, go to the Leonardo AI website and on the left hand side choose training and datasets. And the first thing we want to do is to create a new dataset. So go ahead and click on create new dataset. For the purposes of this video, we're going to call this one test and we're going to put the description as a pixels blonde girl test model. Once you've inputted the details, let's create this dataset. Once you've created your dataset, first thing you have to do is to select the image you wish to train your AI model on. Now, once you've uploaded an image of your choice, on the right hand side, you want to choose the button that says train model to start training the AI on the image that you uploaded. Here we can see a list of all the different training settings that we can have the AI use to train itself on the image we've uploaded. Here we can set the model name, the resolution to be trained in, and a quick model description. The most important part is actually the instance prompt since it'll use this prompt in order to train itself with the images that you uploaded. For now, we're going to pick the prompt Pixel Girl, and when you're happy with all the settings, go ahead and click on Start Training to start the model training program. Training an AI model will take a good amount of time, so we will get an email once it's completed and we'll all just have to wait a little patiently. Once you've set all of that up, as you can see underneath the list of training and datasets, we now have our test dataset, training, and processing. So that's one option of creating and training an AI model by uploading an image. But here, let me show you another way that you can use in order to train another model set. So on the left hand side, let's select AI image generation. From here, we can generate an AI-generated image to use for a model training dataset. As for the default of the Leonardo AI, it uses the DreamShaper version 7. If we click on it, we can see a list of all the models that Leonardo AI makes available for use when AI-generating images. If we choose Select Custom Model, then we can see a list of all the different models that we've trained and the ones that we've actually made ourselves. We can also choose a favorite models list and lots of different models that are available on the platform. Here we can generate with the selected model, which is XQXL 0.9, and with the prompt Pixel Girl, it'll show you all the Pixel Girls in white dresses and a white background that we've AI generated. Another way that we can use to make uh, images for our datasets is to use Canva. Here, we can use Canva to upload our image, make a new Canva project, and edit the image and save it as a PNG file in order to re-upload it back to Leonardo AI so that we can train another dataset using this image. Once you've done all of that, as you can see, if we go back to the training and datasets portion, we can see that we now have two test datasets training with both a test model and a pixel girl. Training these AI model programs really does take a good amount of time, so just be patient and wait for the email from Leonardo AI to alert you that the AI training model process has been completed. And that's really all there is to it. Training a model on Leonardo AI isn't the hardest thing in the world, and we've shown you the step-by-step -step process of how you can get started training your own AI-generated model. Thanks so much for watching guys, and if you have any other questions or concerns, feel free to leave them down in a comment below. Don't forget to like this video if you feel like you've learned something new, and subscribe to the channel for more interesting, quick, and easy content. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you all in the next one.